Hey everyone, um, today I'm bringing you the safest way to charge your lithium ion batteries or lithium polymer batteries. Um, they can be a little bit dangerous to charge. Uh, for myself personally, I haven't touched wood had anything too bad. I have had one that um, discharged and I had to throw away the battery, but that can happen anyway. And um, I think it was Ultrafire brand, so I'm pretty sure it was a fake Ultrafire. Uh, yeah, so this is called LipoGuard. I think it's a generic name for it. Uh, there are a lot of other bags out there that are exactly the same. All it is is a bag uh, that's made out of fiberglass and it's supposed to be fireproof. Um, I have watched a lot of other YouTube videos where they did burn the batteries. Um, some of them, the bag did do a do a good job, and some of them it didn't. It's a bit up and down, but apparently there are fake versions of even these bags going around. Uh, so, and the dealers that you buy these from aren't always the most reputable dealers. Um, I would suggest if you can buy these bags, buy it from somewhere like. Um, DX Extreme or Fast Tech, uh, that would be your two safest bets to buying these bags. Maybe a little bit safer than eBay, unless you know that eBay seller. Uh, all it is is just a bag that you put your batteries in, your lithiums, uh, even Nikkei's. You can charge whatever you want in inside there. They're mainly for um, the lipos, because lipos are a little bit more unstable, so they're mainly to charge those. But you can charge whatever you want in them. All you do is just open up the bag. I don't have my charger with me. I'll just use my phone. You place whatever battery is with the charger in there. And then you close it. And then you charge it. And it's that easy. Uh, yeah, so it is supposed to be flame proof. Um, this one I picked up for $10. It's um, 18 centimeters by 22 centimeters. Uh, I have used it. And um, it doesn't overheat the batteries either. Uh, when I first bought it, I was wondering like, you know, if the batteries are going to get too hot. But um, so far, they've been sweet. And the cord just fits in on the side. And then that's it. Uh, just a couple of tips, guys. Um, never charge your batteries unattended. Always um, make sure you don't have to sit there and stare at them. But just come back and check them every couple of minutes. Um, do not puncture the cells. Uh, when they were testing one of these bags, one of the ways that they tested it was by puncturing a cell and then it blew up and it caught fire. Never overcharge your batteries. Do not over discharge. And use a safety PowerPoint if you have one just in case something does happen. Um, and that's about it because you really got to be careful. Or even if you can, if you've got a garage, something, just charge it somewhere a little bit safer. Maybe don't go to sleep while you're charging polymers or any sort of lithiums. And uh, yeah. But all in all, it does help. Um, the flame, obviously if you've got this sealed properly, there will be less air in there for the flame to um, to produce a bigger fire. And they will smother the fire too. It's not going to do 100% job, but it will also help. It's also good to have something like a, band of, uh, a bucket of sand next to where you charge your batteries and maybe even a fire blanket. Okay guys, uh, this has been uh, Everyday Survival Gear, uh, bringing you... The Lipo Guide. Thanks for watching.